Yeah, taking a look at the latest uh, news out of Wall Street, uh, Facebook has released its earnings report for the second quarter, and the social networking giant appears to be growing by leaps and bounds. Fill us in. Well, investors on Wall Street were all smiles on Wednesday as Facebook pulled in $2.9 billion in quarterly revenue, easily beating market expectations. Facebook stock hit record highs in after hours trading, with its shares having nearly tripled over the last year. Revenue was up 61% on corner, generating a net profit of $791 million. The company said that mobile advertising now made up nearly two thirds of its ad revenue, representing a growth of 20 percentage points from a year ago. This adds the number of monthly mobile active users surged to just over 1 billion as of the end of June. There's really no other place online or in mobile contexts like Facebook, given the global reach given just the sheer number of um, people and businesses and organizations on the platform, and then all the different things that people use Facebook for on a day-to-day -day basis. It really is so unique. Alice also praised Facebook for taking steps to diversify its portfolio and attract younger demographics through the recent acquisitions of instant messaging service WhatsApp and 3D technology firm Oculus. And Charlie, some just breaking news in just the last hour. An Algerian passenger plane has lost contact with air control towers after taking off from Burkina Faso in West Africa. A company source from El Algeria has reportedly said 110 people were on board the plane. We'll give you more updates as they come in in our later newscasts. Yes, uh, sure, uh, sure thing that we're going to update you on this uh, story. So many airplane-related accidents uh, these days. Uh, thank you so much for that uh, update, Paul, and we'll see you back here in just about two hours.